Hello guys, welcome back to another video. This video is sponsored by Audible. Yeah, that um cool app where you can buy stories all over the world, internet or whatever. So today we're going to be talking about a, a very eerie Japanese yokai. And her name is Teke Teke. I'm pretty sure y'all all heard the legend of Teke Teke. It is a spirit of a girl who was thrown off, who was thrown off a train tracks, and the train had the train had basically cut off her legs and skewered them away from her body. Now she is a spirit, killing anyone she sees with legs. She either rips them off of your, off of your legs, or she takes up takes this this side out and slices your body because after that she was just a normal girl but she got bullied a lot in in high school and even after that and some um guys thought it would be funny to place a cicada on her shoulder so they did do that and when she saw it was on her shoulder she screamed in horror trying to get it off until she slipped and fell on the train tracks. The train just passed by and skewered off her legs, killing her. It was a horror tragedy to see. Many people say she came back as an evil yokai to get revenge on the world and humans. What would you do if you guys saw her? Comment down below. I think I would scream, but it's in Japan, so yeah. And here's a clip of a movie that I found. Younger audience, this is pretty gruesome. It was a very sad, tragic story, but I kind of want to mix this up with another legend that I know and found, uh, the Slip Mouth Woman, also known as Coochie Talk, I don't know. So, let's get into that. So, Kuchi Sakayana was a malevolent figure, figure, but at first she was just a normal woman. She was the prettiest woman in town in Japan. And as she knew it, she carried this beauty. And all the people wanted to be her. All the women wanted to be her. All the guys wanted to be with her. But one fateful day, her husband had to go to work. And she felt lonely. So she eventually cheated on him with someone else. He found out. He, t he ran towards her. He either took a sword or a pair of scissors. And slit her mouth from ear to ear. In rage. She either bled out and died from this wound, or she even commuted suicide. And he said, who will you think? I mean, and then he said in this ragey voice, who will think you, pr who will think you're pretty now? And then he left her to bleed out. But he felt so guilty for what he did that he died from a guilt, basically. And she turned into this evil spirit who wanders who wanders around on lonely nights and streets. She loves to do this. Sometimes she'll hunt down kids and ask them, do you, th do you think I'm beautiful? If they are carried by her beauty and they say yes, she will pull down her mask. But if you say no, she'll take out a large pair of scissors and kill you on the spot. But if you say yes, she'll pull her mask 
revealing her slit mouth and you have to do it and you have an well you have to do something if you yell or scream or say no she'll take your scissors she'll take her scissors and make your mouth look just like hers by slitting your mouth and the wounds by her cannot be healed oh people say how do you survive this evil spirit now you can confuse her by saying you're average or saying you're so-so, which I don't know, which in my opinion, I think would make her madder. But in my opinion, her backstory was really sad. But if you do cheat on someone, you're going to have to pay the price. price. So yeah, she turned into like this evil spirit who haunts down children on the loneliest nights and the darkest nights. She'll approach you with a surgical mask and a trench coat with long, beautiful hair. And she'll ask you if you think you are, if she is pretty. Like I said, if you say no, she'll slice your mouth from ear to ear. But if you say yes, she'll basically do the same thing. But if you say, if you say yes both calmly, she'll give you a blood-stained ruby, ruby and leave you. And if you say you don't have time, she'll apologize. So remember, if you ever see a woman in, in, at dark in like a driveway or a street and she asks you if you're pretty, if she's pretty, say you don't have time and do not look back. And they already have a film optation of her. It's called The Slit Mouth Woman or Carved in 2007. And yeah, what would you do if you saw her? I would most percent, 100% if I saw her run away. But some people say if you do try to run away, she'll just teleport to wherever you're going. So she can, not only can she... You know, she can teleport. So, yeah. So, you guys, I hope you liked that video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.